What's good, you guys? Thank you for tuning in. So today's gonna be a little different. I'm gonna go check out this new gym. My boy Mike, he's gonna meet me there, or I'm gonna meet him at his house, I believe. Yeah, but Mike's saying he's gonna hit like a 500 pound deadlift. And I don't really deadlift like that because you guys know I injured my lower back doing deadlifts. So I'm like, I'm, I'm just, I'm just a little cautious. I'm like real cautious now because like that affected my squat. I couldn't squat. It was like a really bad experience and it was for months and months. So I can finally squat again. So I'm happy about that. I gotta work, work on my deadlift form for sure. I mean, that's why I got injured, right? Oh, and by the way, definitely hit that bell, the notification bell. So you guys get updated on every new video I push out so you don't miss it. I'll probably see y'all at Mike's house. My boy Brian brought me over a fancy donut that I'm saving for later because I am fasted right now. I'm going to have a fasted workout. Got that black coffee. You already know what it is. So I'm talking to Mike right now. His Instagram is Cairo Fit with the one. Just ate a fuck ton of Bobo Garden, which is like this Chinese restaurant over here. I'm like jelly. Fasted life. Alright, just pulled up to Mike's place. Shit together. What's what up? Right there. What's going on? I guess Clay's coming with us? Yeah. Never even seen this at Costco. Yeah. Yeah. It's been a while since I've had C4. Hi. Hey cat. I believe this is what Mike is shooting with. Guys gear. Got two and a half scoops of C4 in here. Oh, yeah. I don't I've never heard of anything like this. That's lightweight. That's nothing. He's probably got one of them brains or <laughs> immune system. Or something. Gotta stay in stint, man. She's like, I feel like itchy. I'm like, that's exactly how you're supposed to feel. <laughs> I like that sometimes. <laughs> These guys got their fancy drinks and stuff. <laughs> I got my black coffee. <laughs> you're about that fasting life? I'm not that fat life. My skin black like mumble. Yeah, 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 yeah. Got stash box and hunger. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. There goes Mike. But yeah, I'm pretty impressed. I'm liking this place. It's got the uh, Olympic weights and everything. Never really used those before.
deadlifts, got me sweating. Mike's about to hit the 315. Might go for like a double if it feels good, maybe three. Purple belt. I really like these benches, man. They're like solid. Like elephant is kind of solid. So Mike's gonna tell us a little bit about leg drive and benching. Right now we're gonna go over how to use like, your body as leverage, essentially to bench, not only using your chest and your front delts. Pretty much your shoulders are overloaded, your body just it gives out eventually. If you're not using your core as your main stability, I have the same routine every time I set up for the bench. You can imagine packing your back, squeezing your shoulder blades together, that is gonna be my first step. As soon as I do that, that's where the slight arch in the back is. It's not so much an arch because my butt is so on the bench. Shoulders tight, butt tight, be on your toes. As you push the weight, you can see my legs are contracting as well. That will in turn help you bring the weight up. Squeezing my shoulders, planting my feet. Yeah, this place is like vlog friendly. It's like exactly where I need to be. Yeah. And uh, you know, they like walk by the camera like multiple times and they're like, they look happy about it. So that's like, tight, man. $10 a month, man. I fuck with crunch. This whole setup for probably like 60 bucks total, but I was really impatient. I just had to get it both together. So I caught this shit 60 for like- 60 bucks? Yeah. Like and I dude. paid 80 actually. <laughs> it is what it is. Hey man, you gotta be legit though. <laughs> Everyone has the gorilla pod, so I was like, the person, the type of person I am, I was like, no. I'm not getting that, I'm not getting the iPhone 10, and I'm not getting the Lamborghini, I'm, I'm driving my Accord, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Dude, this thing is dope, man. This setup would be fucking official. <laughs> hey, it's my car, the chiropractor. <laughs> hey, what's up? Oh, 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 oh. Hey, what's up? 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 Hey, what
Damn. So you a bourbon drinker. That shit gets me shitty. I don't know if y'all know, but when you drink alcohol when you're fasted, you hit that buzz much quicker. So Mike was just explaining how you gotta make the head yeah. so you don't get bloated. Yeah, you gotta you gotta create that head of fucking foam. Like a lot of people are like, yo, like that's wasted beer, but honestly, like, yo, if you wanna get the most out of your beer, if you wanna taste all the uh, yeah. You gotta get a little half and half. You gotta get a little mustache yeah. going. I fuck with IPAs and it really opens the flavor up and it just gives you that crisp, really tart flavor. So I just got home with a total wine, got some goodies. Still don't know what I'm gonna eat tonight, but um, I'm gonna think of something. Got that brew, got that victory golden monkey. It's my favorite beer right here, 9.5%. It's going down. We're gonna eat this gourmet donut. Cheers. Pretty gourmet. Gourmet AF. Alright, so we just got back from the store and we got some spinach dip ingredients. And I'm about to cook like a quadruple patty hamburger, like cheeseburger. I'm gonna eat it as fast as I can. We got the garlic onions diced up, got the spinach defrosting. Whip it through the pot. Y'all ain't never had original spinach dip. Y'all ain't live. This man can cook. Not only can he work out well, but he can cook amazing. We got these Heritage Farm beef patties. I'm gonna cook as many as I can on the grill, and then we're gonna decide how many beef patties we're gonna put on this. I've done the unthinkable. I've put six patties, put six pieces of thinly sliced provolone, putting that ketchup on there, some mustard. So we're not gonna have a time limit on this, I'm just gonna eat it as quickly as I can. Got a Snapchat this. All right, got the stopwatch going, let's go. Gotta strategize. Oh my. It's open hard as shit. See the smoke. Get ketchup all over my face. Is this tastier than the nuggets? Nuggets, can't, you can't eat the nuggets. What have I done? The word forgive the gluttony. How are you feeling? I'm not feeling too good. That's why you don't drink in YouTube. You're bulking. I had a good lift today. Yeah, I think I might finish this. I know you can finish it. I've seen you eat two Big Macs. Oh, Jesus. Uh. Uh. I can do this in 10 minutes. I don't know what's more intimidating, that or nuggets. This looks more intimidating for sure than nuggets. Mm -hmm. It's just a big block of meat. You got this, it's like four bites. It just got so difficult. Ah. Uh.
can't do it. That's all I got left, y'all. There's supposed to be six patties, but there's only two patties left. You can make it by 12 minutes. Maybe 15 minutes. 12. So if I eat this now, it'll be 12 minutes. Alright, show them the clock. He will definitely beat that 12 minute mark. Oh my god. Alright guys, I'm never on here, but he did it for the views, I guess. Six patties, that's insane. Is there another challenge on YouTube like this? If there is, let us know down below. I'm good, y'all. That ain't nothing to me, man. 12 minutes. 12 minutes. I want to see you guys make a video. I don't feel good. All right, check out the macros, guys. 124 grams of protein, so I need about 50 more grams. I'll just get that in two protein shakes. This is all I got right here. So that was one pound and a half. Y'all know the deal. 1,900, two protein shakes, probably be like 2,200 calories. Not bad. And of course, you just have to ignore the alcohol. See, if you don't think about it, it's like it never happened. <laughs> all right, I got two scoops of protein right here. Go and drink that. It's morning time, watching Planet Earth on Netflix. Yeah, so I pretty much food coma after last night, but let me show you how much I weigh in today, and I will show you how that hamburger didn't screw everything up. Boom. Look at this sloth, it's swimming. What if it drowns because it's so slow? But anyways, this is the current physique. Still got the abs going. Still got the lower oblique striations. And that's what I'm looking for. You know, I don't want such a huge surplus where it's gonna make my body go to those primary areas where it likes to store fat. And by maintaining an extremely long period, you know, 16 to 24 hours of extremely low insulin levels, does that pretty much set us up for solid maintenance or fat loss. Take that into consideration, guys. If you guys aren't fasting, you can eat like six patties on a burger. 